Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we have a Windows update error, uh, 0x802.4401c. Now this happens um, if it can't reach out to a particular Windows update server, it's getting blocked by your firewall maybe. Uh, in this case, this particular server is trying to communicate to a WSU server. If you don't know what that is, it's almost like a centralized server that approves and manages Windows updates across the infrastructure or in, across your, your lane at your business. Um, so most likely there's going to be a domain connected computer that's having this issue, but you could have this issue at home if you're having internet issues or your firewall is blocking something uh, or something like that. So let's go dive right into it. So if you're getting this error message here, you want to go into your registry. So just go to, uh, you know, command prompt, reg edit, get in there, go to local machine, software, then we're going down to policies, Microsoft, then Windows, and then Windows Update. Then you want to go into the AU area, and then you can see right here, use WU server. So we're going to click in this, and we're going to go to decimal, and we're going to change this value to zero. Hit OK. We're going to go ahead and reboot the machine, and then we're going to try to do Windows Update again and see if that fixes it. But like I said, you have to reboot the machine when you make this change. So let's reboot the machine and see what happens. All right, we rebooted the machine, and we had checked update already, and it's already downloading uh, the newest version of Windows 10 and all the security updates that have been pending forever. Um, so that's great. So now it's updating. Now I have seen, if you don't have this in your registry editor, then you know I have seen people try to open up the command prompt and run this command sfc slash scan now, and that's going to just check your system files and find any corrupted, corruption or anything like that. So you can run this as well if, if the registry thing doesn't work or you don't have that actual key in your registry, then try running this command here. That might help. Um, I hope this video was helpful for you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.